the boys we got ourselves foggy on team red with luddy is luddy gonna go first then we also got divas we got blazy wazy going up first i think luddy and blazy are confused yeah, both of them are confused both of them trying to go uk and on team blue we got ourselves uh Berfa. didn't really get to play last time that well dag <laughs> jiren we got Thantos, and it's going to be Sakati of the bat. Not even going to give the rest of the guys the opportunity to go. It's going to be Wallow of the bat for Blazy. Needs to make all the... Oh, Wall ran out a little bit early, actually. Wow, that duel started before we even got the rest of these boys. It's going to be a port. Blazy is going to get a calm flag on Sakati. Kesbolt trying to come out. Does get a grip on that thing in the last minute moment. Blazy tried to get a fast Kesbolt on him. He's going to land one. Maybe he can get another. Try to get a second one in. Transfusion coming in for Sakati with Lichborn. Lots of defensive, lots of healing, too. Cannot stun Zakati though. That's gonna be an Infernal still. Letting Blazy get all the casts in. Try to get another cast bolt into the back of Zakati, but he barely took a hit from it. I think he just death strike off the Infernal. And the Infernal does go down fairly early. Did he just kill the Infernal the whole time? I feel like 30 seconds it was a little bit too short. That Infernal. Maybe maybe the third seconds did elapse already that fast. That's gonna be gripping the cast bolt. Patsy C coming in. That's exactly what Blazy needed in order to get away from Zakati for just a moment. Try to see if we can line up a fear. Gonna be a Petsy <laughs> Pet stun as the pet just crawls on Blazy like he's a wall. It's gonna set a Cansbolt flight as Zakati. Second one cooking up. That's gonna be a lot of damage into a fear. Incinerate to follow. Zakati actually taking quite a bit of damage, but he's still in there. Does get an interrupt and save the chicken proc it out for him at the very last moment. It's gonna be dead. Up next, Foggy. I'm gonna call him dead because that is the same guy. That's dead, the hunter. Also known as Foggy. While the Shield Avengers is up, Foggy Zakati does go for a death pack to keep his health afloat as best as humanly possible, but that Hodge might separate this. Transfusion coming out right now. Foggy could go for a bop and just deny any kind of healing for Zakati, but he believes in his damage. He thinks he can just do it. Zakati is not really able to get Pilpel back up. But is he able to stay afloat for now? Stone looking to Foggy. Bob coming out. It looks like Zakati is done. He does get chained of ice, though, so that is an opportunity for dead. That is the course of action if you go for a bop instead of a bubble. Bubble makes you immune to all attacks. Bob keeps you susceptible to magic ones. So interrupts and chain of ice. All that is going to go. Zakati barely caught with any health. Trying to death strike as much as he can. But Foggy does get a nice crit with the Templar's verdict. Taking Zakati out at the end of it all. Hodge and Jaren. Jaren? Jaren? Is it Jaren? I think it's Jaren. Foggy versus Jaren. That's going to be Shield Avengers procking out a little bit early. Jaren popping the cooldowns a little bit too. Before he can really get some damage to the Foggy, but that's gonna be a hard with way he's not gonna be in a bubble out of Foggy. Bubbles it while at high health. Very interesting move. Decide not to let Jiren get his health low at all. And just gonna clap damage back into Jiren. Doesn't have rebuke to interrupt him on his cast of heals. That's gonna be just mobility. We'll try to stay away from the wings of Jiren. He's gonna stay away from it all. That is gonna be a huge defensive use by Foggy, though. Insanely huge defensive. Wings. That's his biggest one, the biggest button. Is he going to be able to force the same cooldowns out of Jiren? Though Jiren is calling on to his defenses, at least for now. Bubba coming out, why is it lower health? So maybe for Foggy, this might be good. Does get the full, to full, what is the 30 second duration wings. That's going to be his full wings. Does get an interrupt on a holy cast. Jiren is not going to be able to even bop himself. For Baron's is still up on him. He has all health, barely anything left. And Foggy does get to clap him out though. That is an opportunity that Foggy took care of here. Bubbling early so he doesn't ever drop below in health while Jiren kind of let the damage go through with Foggy. Bubbled and Foggy still had the full wings available even right afterwards. That is up next. Get a hard drop. Trick inside of it immediately. Cloak of Shadow is getting burned for that Shield of Vengeance. Has evasion if he needs to. And Foggy's kind of out here in the open without a defensive to spare. Hand of Freedom is the only thing that kind of keeps him separated from the rogue. But Thantos now just needs to get a big old vendetta. He does actually already have a vendetta rolling on the dead. He just needs to connect with the. Paladin goes for a sap. Needs to go for a cheap shot. Garoad. Tricky coming out for Foggy. Immediately does get a Garoad. Foggy needs to get another Hodge and a middle on wings available on Thantos. Big DFA coming down. Actually does quite a bit of damage. But Foggy does get to get himself a flash of light in there. Looks like Thantos doesn't have a kick for that. Gonna shot coming in. It's gonna be internal bleeding layered on top of all this other dots. Flash of lights for Foggy again. Blind while he's low. And that just looking just to get a full reset onto Foggy and take him out right then and there. He probably does have the chance here. No trick out available for Foggy. No bubble, no bop. 
Gauch coming in. Yo, Garo coming in. He's standing in Poison Bomb. Not the best opportunity. Does get a hard on the so Could that be the end of the Rogue right now? Foggy doesn't have wings, but he still does have the big Chris. Just turns it around onto Rogue. Just like that. Like as if it's nothing. He should give him the opener. He should give him the opener. He just gave you an auto duel. Aim shot and he's gonna line it. And Burfa is gonna be out in the open. He needs to keep dead out in the open if he wants to get the big damage. Does get a freezing trap. It looks like Foggy does have a trinket rolling or something. Aim shot in his back. It's gonna get quite a bit of damage though. Was that a double tap aim shot? Foggy actually gonna knock back a bit. Doesn't have defenses still against this hunter. That's gonna be a big cleave with that Templar's Verde. Gonna be tricked out of a Burfa. That's gonna be turtle shell immediately. Foggy is gonna go flash a light in himself. And a Burfa needs to get himself some sort of a setup to take Foggy down. As long as he can heal. Not gonna go behind stealth, behind the pillar. He's just gonna run at this hunter right now. Feeling pretty confident. Does he have wings available? I think he does have big wings if he even needs to use them. Trying to see if he can stay away from a Burfa in case there's a freezing trap. And a Burfa is gonna go for cooldowns. Gonna get one aim shot off in there. Burfa needs to get the line of sight onto dead, onto Foggy. In order to get this going. Foggy's just gonna wait inside for a little bit. Get him flash lights. That's gonna get that mount up so he can get that mobility in there. Aberfa's cooldowns is going to be done very, very soon. Tar Trap not stopping this Paladin. Aberfa needs to get some sort of CC chain going to separate themselves from the Pallet. Is going to go for that survival of the fittest. Knocking Foggy back again. Not going to be able to get rid of him, though. At least that easily. Foggy has Shield Avengers if he needs to. Going to be a big aim shot. That needs to do a lot of damage, but Judgment is going to finish him off just like that. And Dog. <laughs> again, how'd you get that name? <laughs> How did Blizzard let you? <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna be a shield of vengeance for dead right now. Foggy. Vendetta, uh, Bob coming up back very, very soon though. And Dog got so much Vendetta damage. It's actually gonna get slowed out in the open. He's gonna sprint at Foggy. Try to see if he stay up to him. Eight seconds left for Foggy before he can get his Bob up and running. Safety trick is gonna keep him afloat. Three seconds available for the Bob. Is he gonna be able to live long enough? Bob is available right now if he needs it. Should be using it. Still can be nature damage through Dog. He's gonna go for the wings. Flash of lights coming out back to back. Making sure to kill himself up to full. Is gonna cleanse himself of poisons. And Dog is gonna get back in there. Actually opened up a little bit. Oh, he did get a sap. I think it was, it was trying to go for damage, but it actually was a sap animation that he was going for. They tried to sap Foggy out of that. That's still Wings of Ill Foggy. Gonna open up with a kidney shot. Foggy in 30 seconds has bubbled them. See, if worse comes to worse, he can live it. Dog doesn't have a trick anymore. Clock Shot is coming in. Hopefully, he didn't get a hunch. Actually, Foggy might be in a bad situation again. So much damage. Running out of Poison Bomb. Does Foggy have a stun for the Rogue? Does he catch a Flash of Light very, very quickly? 13 seconds left on a bubble. Another Flash of Light available. Kill the shot, though. Is that going to be the end of Foggy? Has nothing left this time at all. Trying to Flash of Light at the last moment. Going to get interrupted. Barely any health. The dog actually takes him out. All that damage. Had everything rolling. And Dog just took him out so much damage out of this rogue. It's actually not even funny. I thought he had it at a bop. Jesus. All right, Dog. Can you do it against Luddy, though, man? Can you do it against Luddy? Let me coach at him. Let me add him, coach. Hell yeah, dude. Luddy versus Dog. It's going to be big hands bolts. If Dog takes out this just a Warlock, though, Luddy, this would be insane. Because not a lot. that doesn't happen a lot. He's gonna go for the pet CC of the bad. Does land a cheap shot towards the end though, but still, it's gonna be an opportunity for Letty to go for some massive CC. This has to go for a Cataclysm into Conflag into Dog immediately. And incinerates. Doesn't want to go for big, big damage yet. Big damage coming out for Dog though with a massive vendetta. Gonna get feared out while attacking Letty. Done a little bit of a dance, done a little bit of a, a kick up there. That's gonna go for a concoction. Smoke bomb coming down as Cancel's trying to come out for Letty. A Dog still has a massive vendetta rolling on Letty. He could go trying to cash it in, but it's going to be cooldowns for Letty right now. Without that Inferno, he's just going to wait him out. It looks like he is going to try to catch a resell. Does get a cheap shot in there with a grow to follow. Does he have any more damage, though? No fear available. No cloak shot is available for dogs. It's going to be pretty bad, man. It's going to be a pretty bad experience. Does get a kidney. As the Inferno comes down, poison him on Brocket for Luddy, and he stands in it. That's going to be a horror effect to get him away. It's going to be a blind off of that. Does he get that Chaos Bolt in? Dog is out in the open. Malik to follow. Fear available on him, and the Chaos Bolt to run after that. Down he goes. Nothing you can do against a warlock. Damn, Foggy actually played pretty well there as a pala. Pretty good. Pretty good, man. Pretty good. Alrighty.